from uh, the Tenke Fungurumu mine in the Katanga, quite, quite, really a lovely piece. I, I just struggled to get a good angle uh, 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 for t photography here. The matrix is almost a brissiated young dolomite matrix, and sitting on top of that would be a thin layer of druzy quartz crystals. Almost a, so it would have been this compact section which got infiltrated by the druzy quartz. We'll see in this black, uh, in this section uh, the brownishness to blackishness would be some heterogeneous trapped underneath. I wonder, I think here we're just looking at a almost a cast of the druzy quartz sitting on top of it. Also associations I've found on this particular section would be waxy blue-green botroids of what I believe to be um, pseudo malachite. So not the malachite, pseudo malachite, little waxy uh, uh, blue-green botroids. I, uh, on this particular section, I don't expect to find Krasikala. So what we'd have here is a, 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 a cast almost of Druzy quartz running across this 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 matrix, um, and of course some heterogeneity associated quite typically, and of course this again having been covered by this layer of Druzy quartz. All the way from the Tenke Fungurumu mine in the Katanga. From a display point of view, uh, this is rather appealing. This particular angle, it's a, it's almost dendritic formation up up on that section, going around like this, or even going across like that. This is actually, I think, this to me would be the most appealing. <laughs> 